Let's dive into a practice that can truly transform your life. It's a simple yet profound ritual you can do just before bedtime. Something you can write down and place under your pillow that has the potential to unleash incredible changes in your reality. I'm gonna share with you the science behind it, how it works, and why it's so powerful. First, let's understand the foundation of this practice. It's all rooted in the quantum model of reality, which I've discussed in my books and lectures. The quantum model tells us that all possibilities exist in the present moment. That means your dreams, your desires, your goals, they all exist right here, right now in the quantum field. Now the key is to align yourself with these possibilities. And that's where our practice comes in. You see, your thoughts and emotions are like tuning forks. They carry specific frequencies. Your thoughts are your intentions, your directions, and your emotions are the energy, the carrier of those thoughts. Imagine your thoughts are like tuning a radio dial. When you're in a certain emotional state, it's like tuning into a specific frequency. And when there's a vibrational match between your energy and the potential that exists in the quantum field, it's going to find you. So what emotion are we aiming for here? Gratitude. Why? Because gratitude is the emotional signature that the event has already occurred. When you're genuinely grateful, you're signaling to the universe that you're aligned with that desired outcome. You're living in the future, in the present moment. So here's what you need to do, and it's incredibly simple. Five minutes before you sleep, take a moment to reflect on your dreams, your desires, and your goals. Write them down as if they've already happened. Imagine that your prayers have been answered. Your your dreams have come true and feel the emotion that goes along with it. What would you feel if your dream came true? Excitement, joy, inspiration, gratitude. That's what you want to embody in that moment. Feel it as if it's happening right now. Now let's talk about why this works. When you do this, you're not just thinking about your dreams, you're feeling them. You're not just setting intentions, you're aligning your emotions with those intentions. And remember, it's the combination of clear intention and elevated emotion that truly affects matter. When you're in that state of gratitude, your body is living in that future reality. You're no longer a somebody trying to get there. You become a nobody in the present. In that state of pure consciousness, you're walking through the door into the quantum field. Now let's go through the steps of this practice together. Sit up straight and take a slow, steady breath. As you inhale, lift the muscles in your perineum, both front and back, as if you're pulling energy up. Then, as you follow your breath, move to the second center, pulling in your belly button close to your spine. Keep following your breath up into your upper abdomen, locking down this center. Continue following your breath through your chest, shoulders down through your throat, and straighten your spine. As you reach the top of your head, inhale a bit more and lock those muscles down even further. You're lifting them up while focusing your attention on the top of your head or the space where your pineal gland is. Now here's the crucial part. You have to demonstrate a will that's greater than any program, any addiction to emotion. You have to be inspired and your energy needs to be in motion. Don't just do it once or twice and give up. Think about how long you've been thinking and feeling in those old patterns. It might take some time to shake them loose. When you practice this breath, your body might do unusual things, and that's okay. It's a sign that energy is moving into your brain. You might even have lapses of consciousness. It's all part of the process. Surrender into it. Your body is adjusting to this new energy flow. So to recap, five minutes before sleep, write down your dreams as if they've already come true. Feel the gratitude as if it's happening now. Then, perform the breathwork exercise I showed you. It's a slow, steady breath, coordinating with muscle contractions to push cerebrospinal fluid into your brain. And remember, the key is to trust the outcome, to trust the unknown. Don't analyze how or when it will happen, because that's returning to your old self. The new you trusts the process. 
Now let's talk about the magic that happens when you consistently practice this ritual. As you consistently align your thoughts and emotions with your desires, you become a magnetic force within the quantum field, and the universe responds in incredible ways. Your consciousness begins to harmonize with the greater consciousness of the cosmos itself. This is where the real transformation takes place. Your brain, the seat of your thoughts and perceptions, starts to function in holism. Both hemispheres of your brain fire in synchrony, creating a symphony of coherence that amplifies your creative potential. This harmonious state extends to your heart as well, and it's something we can measure using advanced technology. Your heart enters a state of coherence, where its rhythm becomes harmonious and balanced. We can see this on our heart rate and brainwave monitors. When your heart heart and brain are in sync, you're in the perfect state to manifest your desires. This coherence is not just a physiological phenomenon, it's a reflection of your inner state. It's a sign that you are in alignment with your dreams and that you're resonating with the frequencies of the quantum field. We've witnessed this transformation in our students over and over again. As they enter this state, tears of joy roll down their faces. They become so whole and happy that wanting becomes impossible because how can you want when you're already whole? That's the moment when miracles happen. You see, this practice is a bridge from the old self to the new self. It's like crossing a river. You know there's another side to that river and you have the passion, the intensity and the will to get there. You must move beyond your old thought patterns, beyond your unconscious states of mind and body. And when you do, you liberate a tremendous amount of energy, energy you can use to design a new destiny. Remember, the quantum field is where all possibilities exist, but to access it, you must become a nobody. In other words, you need to get beyond your body, your personality, your environment, and even time. When you practice this ritual consistently, something truly remarkable unfolds. You step into a profound shift in your reality. Imagine yourself as a vortex, a swirling force within the quantum fabric of the universe. You're no longer in the pursuit of your dreams. Instead, your dreams are irresistibly drawn towards you. This shift represents a transition from third dimensional creation to fifth dimensional creation. In the third dimension, manifesting your desires often requires a laborious process, effort, time, and often a sense of struggle. But in the fifth dimension, a higher level of existence, you become the magnet that effortlessly attracts your desires through your energy. During those precious five minutes before sleep, you're not merely jotting down your dreams, you're actively co-creating your reality. You enter the quantum field as a nobody, shedding the limitations of your ego, and you surrender to the universe's innate intelligence. It's here, in this state of surrender and alignment, that the universe's magic begins to orchestrate the fulfillment of your dreams. And as you perform the breathwork exercise, remember that it's about intensity, inspiration, and persistence. Keep practicing, keep shaking loose those old patterns, and you'll find yourself closer to your dreams than ever before. Give this practice a try. You will be amazed at the miracles that start unfolding in your life.